On behalf of EFDD, Mrs. Barker, two minutes. Thank you, Madam President. Commissioner, this report discusses many aspects that I wholeheartedly support. Gender equality, access to education, eradicating discrimination, and the prevention of violence against women. But more importantly, what this report touches on, which I definitely condemn, is the absolutely horrific human rights violations which takes place in Libyan detention centres. Women at the hands of Libyan coastal guards are subjected to gang rapes, men beaten to death, there is no food, no basic amenities and appalling unimaginable living conditions. These are the same coastal guards that the EU are training. One cannot begin to imagine the fear, terror and despair of these victims. This is despite prior warnings from human rights organizations that warned of the exacerbation of such crimes. The UN Human Rights Chief stated the EU's policy of assisting the Libyan Coast Guard was inhumane, and that's increasing interventions by the EU have done nothing to reduce the level of abuse suffered by migrants. What checks does the EU have in place to oversee this operation? Has the Commission investigated this and what are they doing about it? Are they reassessing the collaboration with the Libyan Coast Guard? Thank you. Thank you, Shun.